please subscribe to my youtube channel and press the bell icon to get the latest update and videos let's move to the next question next question is related to the installation of kernel they have given you the repository link so first of all you have to you know create your repo file and in the repo file you have to put the entry which is given in your question after that what you need to do you have to upgrade the kernel first you need to check what is the current version of the kernel your system is running with which kernel version and then you have to update the kernel and take the reboot of your system and check that kernel version has been updated or not so this is what you have to do in this question so let me move to the lab session so that i can show you how we can do this so first of all you have to create the repo file so you can give any name whatever you want and after that you have to put some entry here like kernel repo name so whatever you want you can put it here the main important thing is this base url so here you have to put the same entry whatever shown in the question paper content dot example dot com rhl seven point two x eighty six underscore sixty four let me cross check what was the it was erita and then gpg check is equal to zero I do not want it should be checked enable is equal to one so this is what you have to do it in this save and then you have to you know do em repo list and check for that whatever the contents you we have in this repository is it showing on your client machine or not this is what you have to do it so we have to fire the command em repo list so it is started showing what are the package we have on that repository and after that you need to fire this command em install kernel or you can simply fire this command em update also and one more thing i just forget what was the kernel version I'm just pressing no here, and uh, let me show the kernel version. You name hyphen a. So currently it is showing this one. Okay, and uh, copy this one. It's three point one zero one three point one zero zero two two nine. And this will be updated to this one. It's a new kernel version. So this is what you have to do it in the exam the same way. The steps which I have shown you, exactly the same steps you have to follow. After that, it will take and reboot here. And once the server will come up, it will come up with the new kernel version. This is what the question is all about. Let me take a pause here. Pause here. Now you can see that it has been done now. All the twenty-three packages has been installed now. Okay, let me show you. 
okay if i am fire this command it is still showing the old one so let me take a reboot here we'll take a pause here now my system has come up now let me check the version of kernel after doing the upgradation of kernel so i'm going to take a terminal here now i'm going to fire the command uname hyphen r now you can see that the kernel has been updated earlier it was something 3.10.0-329 now it has been updated to 327 so this is what the question all about you have to you know upgrade the kernel so whatever the steps i have shown in this lecture you have to follow the same steps so thanks for watching and if you have time please join with me in the next lecture